Hi, today we're gonna make some delicious chicken cordon bleu in the Dutch oven. We're gonna do some baked potatoes first. So we're gonna kind of get things going. I'm gonna put some briquettes right here. About, let's do about like that. Get this, because what I wanna do is we're gonna do the chicken cordon bleu in the 12 inch Dutch oven here. Set that there. Lifter. We're going to put some butter in here. It's about two thirds of a cube. And let that start melting right there. And then in the 10 inch Dutch oven, this is what we're going to cook the potatoes in. So I want eight on the bottom for 400 degrees. Like that. Set that 10 inch Dutch oven. And then what we did, these are just your russet potatoes we just kind of slid them and then I put a little avocado oil and then just some pepper and we're just gonna bake these like you would in the oven but in the Dutch oven so let's grab this other kickstand lid lifter get that lid off I'm just gonna set all these potatoes in here like this Put the lid back on so 400 degrees with the 10 inch dutch oven we have eight on the bottom we want 16 on top four eight four that's pretty good right now so i'm guessing about since our slid open probably 45 minutes on that so those will just we're done there they can just cook and bake along so let's see what we got going here actually we need that butter to melt up yeah it's getting hot today I woke up and it was about 33 degrees outside and I planned on going to a meet with some some of my buddies on the bikes and I saw 33 degrees and I'm just like I don't know it might be a little bit too cold but I got this cool heated little coat that goes under my leather jacket, so I put it on and it was a beautiful ride today. Went out and rode for a few hours, awesome. It's kind of cloudy now, but so we've got the melted butter and I have two cups of breadcrumbs. So I'm just gonna stir this in with the butter. Maybe I should have let that melt a little bit more, but what we wanna do here, here, let me move some of these. Is just get these breadcrumbs coated with this butter a little bit. So I'm actually going to let that melt down, and then we'll be back shortly to start building the chicken cordon bleu. The potatoes are just they're they're ready right there, so we'll be right back. Okay, here we go. We put a little bit more butter. I had two thirds of a cube, and then we put about another half. So there's probably about a cube and a quarter and two cups but see you just want to get them breadcrumbs good and moist with that butter and then we're going to pull it out yeah that looks good and then we'll put this back in later so just about like that Looks good to me. Okay, now what we want to do is I have six chicken breasts, but I cut them in half so they're just kind of like strips. Well, half a breast. So just kind of just set them in here. Hey, that sizzle. Yummy. You don't have to cut them in half. I mean, we just like to cut ours in half. They, they seem to cook really good like this, and it looks cool too. <laughs> so, I guess. Look at that, that's gonna fit perfect. And then what I did here is uh, I got some ham and I had the deli slice it 
thick. It's about a quarter inch. And we're just going to lay a piece of ham on each one of these chickens. The ham's a little long. That's okay. Just kind of top these. Oh, this is going to be good. Like this. Look at that. And then, the pan's getting heavy. And then Swiss cheese, and I had the deli slice that extra thick too. So you just kind of layer this on. If there's something else you think you'd want on your chicken cordon bleu, just layer it on here with it. But this is so good, and you know, we're building this, and then we just let it cook and do its thing. And okay, there's one hiding. Well, let's put it right there. Okay. So there's that. And now we put our breadcrumbs back in there. So I'm just gonna kind of sprinkle this all on top. Like so. And this will cook. I was thinking about 40 minutes, and we thought 45 on the potatoes, so it all should come out right around the same time. So there's that. So, with the 12 inch Dutch oven, we want 10 on the bottom. So, let's see what we got here. It's going to pull, there's five, five. Here, let's scoot these over. 10 on the bottom. Kind of get them in a circle. Like that. Set that on there. And then we want 18 on top. So that's four. Pretty good, like that. I got ash all in that bowl, but that's all right. So 18, 10 and 18 on top for the 12 inch Dutch oven. This is uh, eight and 16 here, so we're just gonna set the timer, maybe we'll check it in 30, but we'll decide at that point, so we'll see you back. Okay, let's check this out. It's been 30 minutes, so let's see how this is coming along here. Here we go. Holy smoke, look at that, that's doing awesome. I'm gonna set that down. Let's check out those breadcrumbs. Look at that, they're browning up nice. So yeah, we. We'll just let this cook 15 more minutes, but yeah, that cheese is doing good. We don't need to look at the potatoes, they're wrapped up, but I'm sure they're doing fine, so we'll give this another 15 minutes, we'll be back. Okay, we're ready, I think we're good. So let's pull the, the lid off the potatoes. Just gonna set it there. Grab one of these. Yeah, look at that. It's nice and steamy. Hot potato. So, put the lid back on here. Let me grab a fork, knife, and I'll kind of cut this up a little bit. But look at that. That cooked pretty dang good there. So, there's that. Kind of get a little sour cream. Man, this smells good. There's a little green onion, but look at that. That is delicious. Okay, now let's get the chicken cordon bleu. Oh man. Look at those breadcrumbs, that's perfect. The cheese, it's all kind of trying to find where one of the chickens is. Pull that out of there, look at that. I grabbed two hams. Uh, no. I thought that was another ham, but it was a cheese. Or maybe I'm seeing it wrong. No, it's two hams. <laughs> it's two hams. 
Okay. One of those goes with one of the other ones. So I'm gonna set this right there on my gloves so I can cut this and try this out. So look at that, that chicken cooked up great. Mm. Let's try it out. It's hot though. Be careful. Mmm. Mmm. Hot. Man, I took a big bite. No, it was hot. I couldn't talk for a minute. That is delicious. Let's try these potatoes. Mmm. The flavor of that is so good. So there you have it. Chicken cordon bleu in the Dutch oven. Baked potato in the Dutch oven. Gotta love cooking outdoors. I hope you like this video. We'll see you next time.